going to start this up, and then we're going to start right, this. Bio's done. Okay. Do I do I care? Do I care? Should I look at it's this? It's going to like evolve over time. Yeah. All right. That's that's evolve dark. or devolve. <laughs> Hello, everyone. My name's Rizipa, and today we're back in D and D. Uh, we have all of these people. You can see their faces down there and all that. They can introduce themselves if they'd like. Whoa. The names are there. They can read. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Great job, guys. All right. <laughs> We're back. Uh, right? my, my name's Gab. I'm a bard. I'm Henzoid. I'm a minotaur. Rar. Progeria Squid. I am Draconis. Halo, and I'm a elf paladin. What's your name, Halo? Allie. I, I, I don't even know how to pronounce my own name, okay? The, the he's names he's are, a beautiful The names are actually thought. in there, so it's... We, they can I see. only see my name. To be I honest. made it that way. I um, forgot Halo was a girl. My name is Witsy. Yes. I'm a Cancer. I like long walks <laughs> on the beach. Anyways, we're playing D&D, &D, and we are back in whatever the hell we were doing in our last adventure. What were we doing? Were we in a village, like... Well, no, weren't we in, like, a flood market type now. thing? The market. And, uh, we were scared Geben... the shit out of the villagers. Yeah, I think yeah, you guys were, plundering. were definitely, uh, yeah. Oh, yeah, I just, like, stole a table full of, like, celery, was it? No, no, I paid no. for I paid for it. And then I gave the little girl a doll. I forgot about that. Is that oh, what you did? Yeah, yeah I forgot. Just carrying around children's dolls with you for no reason. Because I'm a bard. That's what I do, is I bring music and joy to you people. Use them to lure children. <laughs> yep, yeah. that's what I do. I'm like, free candy written on the side of the bear. carriage. <laughs> oh, God. Free candy, Free come on in. Made not creepy dolls. Don't okay, so let's assume that you guys actually figured out what the hell you were doing in this flea market. Uh, are you? Do you guys want to stay, or do you guys want to like continue on adventuring? Uh, I don't know. Let's keep going. You guys got a well, bunch of food, but job. I think that was it. We think like a flea market, and we didn't grab a single bit of supplies. All we did was scare the locals. Thank, grab... thank God, someone finally thought it out. <laughs> Was there was there an instrument shop? I wanted to go to an instrument shop. An instrument. We have, shop. We have enough I great instruments. Help us. Okay. We, we have, I'm a board. It's so helpful. you. I think we're good. So My you you find a uh, Geb, you find a traveling band of minstrels that are sitting off to the side, and they <laughs> are conveniently selling all the instruments your heart could desire. Can I buy a saxophone? <laughs> you can buy a saxophone if you'd like. <laughs> yeah. Can I buy the didgeridoo? <laughs> you can, but <laughs> good luck. Have you guys played a song? Can I buy a QWERTY hop? I, you can, you can sure I try. Bought, I bought a saxophone. Uh, a saxophone's 400 is... gold. Oh, wow. Shit! That's... I've got, I've got a hundred. For like 10 gold, what the f Yeah. What? Man. Actually, that makes sense. That 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 does add up. In band, yeah. my I sax was sixteen hundred bucks. So I mean, Jesus, we gotta have some type of inflation really? here. Jesus. Yeah. So I How is that damn. inflation? Don't How worry about that. The the land of the land of uh, D and C doesn't have math skills. But anyways, who asked what? <laughs> How much gold do we have? That was up to you guys based on your backgrounds and everything. Yeah, it tells you in your backgrounds. Gab's got, super rich. Most well, most people probably aren't gonna have more than a hundred. Gab yeah, has I mean, stats. My, my character's of noble birth. I don't know how much gold that'd give me. I mean, shit. For all you know, you probably have like a vault sealed away with like a million gold or something. Oh, like Harry Potter style. Just yeah. In the bottom of a giant. Oh, animal. and there are goblins in this. So. <laughs> Squid is back. Squid. Squid never really left. In Squid our hearts. Had to cute. Squid never leaves you guys' hearts. Squid. See, watches over you. I want to look at the other, at you guys talking. Then I realize I should probably look at the camera. Look at the camera. Look at us. It's either way. It doesn't matter. All right. Uh, I'm good. I'm ready to head out. My squid's I'm looking everywhere. Too. So is everyone ready to adventure? Yeah. Yes. Because I mean, you sure. would notice if squid would look anywhere. It'd take like a minute for it to register. <laughs> 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 I'm sorry. Everyone's poking poking fun at the squid today. Um, hey, come on, guys. So I guess guys I'll put the harness back you. on. <laughs> oh, that's right. You were carrying the carriage. We're, 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 this market could have... <sighs> this market could oh, have supplies you may need to survive later on. This market what? could have things of your utmost desires, but it also could have, let's get the fuck out of here. So, uh, a squid's going to look but around and see if there's any information. needed supplies. Um, yes, you find a general trader squid, and he has... Um, he... 
I guess you walk up to him and he comes up to you in a gruff voice. Well, uh, what are you doing here? What do you need? Uh, Speed I, I need to go on a road trip for a few days. Beard. Speed and beard. Beard. Uh, uh, I don't sell any supplies. Not to your kind. Racist! Is it because I'm a squid, sir? Yes. Oh. I don't actually know what you are. I forgot. I, I think you were a dragon elf. elf or something. Okay. Dragon. Yeah. Dragon elf. You elf kind. You scare us. Oh. I, I walk I walk over hearing this conversation. I go, what you say, boy? I'm you. Gonna point over oh. to the rest of the group and be like, would you rather one of them come up? You, you and your non-human things have been ruining our good Thanos values. And, uh, oh. I just can't. I, we can't take it. Sir, is your I name Trumpius? Over. <laughs> <laughs> I, yes. I politely yell, I'm part Donius human, Trumpius. so let me handle this. You know what? Fine. And he just he throws a pack of general supplies at you. Just get out of my face. I don't want to deal with you people. God oh, damn it, okay. Robin blind Wait, Let's hold go. on. Hold on. Hold on. Can I cast friends cantrip on him? <laughs> if you really want to. <laughs> I cast friends cantrip on him. Well, you have to ask. You're gonna have it's to work. You have to you roll your just, whatever. I don't. I don't think I have to roll. Magicking the, re, magicking everybody. Repercussions for charming and using your magic on everything you see. You gotta I remember, a, it's a cantrip. People can still see it though. People can detect it. There are magical oh, people knows, in the he world. He knows as soon as he, as soon as I do it, he's he knows and he's angry. Oh, so but you're the GM friendly. now, okay? No, no, no. It's part. It's literally in the spell. Oh, like, as soon as he sees it, yeah, yeah. he becomes. When a spell ends, the creature realizes that you use influ influence and becomes hostile towards you. Uh, damn. I have advantage on all charisma checks directed at my one creature of your choice. For how long? Uh, or does it even say? Duration, one minute. <laughs> one minute? You got yeah. one minute to get some info and stuff out of him? Okay, tell well, me, your, tell me everything that I need to know, sir. Over roll, all of the supplies. roll a charisma check. <laughs> Alright, hold what, on. What's uh, the number to your safe? Yeah, well, the le less than... Oh, I have advantage. Uh, He needs to... My spell save is 13. Your spell save is 13? Okay, so yeah, it, it succeeds then. So what are you doing? Okay. Uh, I wanted to ask, like, what's the information, like, about our quest? Oh, yeah. I asked him questions about our quest. I, I didn't even know you were on a quest. I'm sorry. Well, no, I, I tell him about the quest, and I ask him... It might take no longer than a minute. What are you? What are you doing? What? Shh, where, where are you going? Shh. Squid, shh. I don't remember Whoa. where we're going. Where it's, are we going? It's, it's the Fandelver mission. Give you all okay. This stuff. Uh, we're going to Fandelver. Fandelin. Fandelin, thank you. Uh, that that's about. He he points off in a general direction. That's about three days way over way over yonder. But uh, you gotta watch. You gotta watch out because there's a there was a character. Hey, you're using your magic on me. No, get out of my face. I don't want to deal with you no more. Uh-uh. <laughs> yeah, sorry, but it has. Gu guards, guards, people using magic on us. And then he's, he calls all over the guards. We get the fuck the out. <laughs> and the, the big band of mercenaries in the back is getting really riled up and is starting to walk towards you. Uh, and I mean, I'm like, get in the battle. fucking car. I mean, let's see that. Run! How, how close are they Come with me if you want to live. They're still pretty far oh, away. Oh, They're oh. a good distance away, but okay. I okay. Battle. So, so I guess you back. guys are right. you guys are running. Yeah. This is what oh, happens. I'm, not, I'm running. Like, yeah, not this is what happens magic. when Geb does stuff. I'm Snow walking at a leisure. I need to rip off a goat leg. Not this time. Okay, so yeah, I guess you guys are. I just book it because I'm the one holding the cart. Okay, so I guess you guys are just kind of running, hobbling off, and yeah, you guys leave. Yeah. The, the guards, the yeah. guards, kind of start running for a little bit, and then they're like, "Ah, oh, whatever. We got other things to do." <laughs> the fast security guards are just like, "I'm good." Paul they're, Blart. Yeah, it's it's these guys are Paul Blart style. Like these dudes are. <laughs> us no more. These dudes are very large, and since they don't have segways in the D and D world, they can't really go far. So. They have magic segways. They have pedal segways. <laughs> okay, so yeah, you guys. So you guys oh, notice. Hold or, on. What? Sorry. A pedaled segway? Yes, it's a pedaled segway. That's it, a unicycle. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, a segway Wait. has two tires. <laughs> It's a bicycle. A oh, that is a unicycle. Bike. Yeah, that's a unicycle if it only has one tire, then. <laughs> no, but no, it's... a Segway has two. Yeah, but you said they're oh, pedaled Segways. Right. A Segway does have two. 
Okay. Just kind of segue. All right, so, so these guards, these guards bicycle. decide not to uh, worry about getting on their pedaled Segway as you guys are running away. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> you guys can take. You guys continue have, like, on down page. the area, and um, stop. you continue on down, blast through groups of people and all that good stuff, and you. Do we kill anyone? No. Why would you kill anyone? No, no, I mean, this is a... black of people. Do we trample anyone in our way? No, everyone just... jumps out of your way and screams, ah, and you hear, like, babies flying through the air and things like that. It's, it's... We just... Oh. You're well, we're on a busy road, and no one is walking the other way. Just no, someone work. saw a minotaur barreling through them, and everyone's running. <laughs> <laughs> we're causing yeah, mass chaos. Thanks. Yes, you're you're causing a lot of chaos for just starting your mission. We're officially three star fugitives. Yes, yes, you I'm, I'm you guys shoot are wanted. At the chasing guards with my arrows. This is now GTA. If, if you want, like, in a, this is GTA Minotaur Cart Edition. Can we, okay. can we keep going, people? Okay, so yeah, you guys are going or, on down the freaking field that the goblins. If you guys remember, there was goblins in this story. Uh, they, yeah. <laughs> they, they kept, they ran off. Uh, you r vaguely recall that the shopkeeper you so charmed earlier started speaking about goblins before the effects wore off. Damn it. Hello? You right there? What? No. Dog got caught in my, uh, mic. One oh, okay. <laughs> Train your pants. Look at this guy. Professional. I see that Black Ops poster in the background. I do too. Or is that Ghosts? It's, no, it's Black, Black Ops. Ops. No. There's no Sorry Black Ops in D and D. You, you, there may That's be. Unimpressive. You never know. What if he's not in the D and D world? Dun dun dun. They could be elf, elven Black Ops. Mm. Do 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 do. Yes. Yeah, <laughs> Okay, so yeah, you guys are hobbling on off, and you're getting to this very, very large fork in the road. You can tell because there is a massive tree in the uh, the center of the fork, and you have a path that goes left and a path that goes right. Henswood, why? Rolling four D100s. Uh, well, you only needed an eight to get that, but 355 works. <laughs> <laughs> okay. No, but okay, so you guys are uh, between two paths. I say uh, left. Mm, what do the paths look like? Like, let's look at one path, let's look at the other path. Okay, so the left path is, it seems to be very traveled. There's lots of um, cart marks, and you can see that it's it's walked very frequently. There are a few small groups of people uh, you can see down the horizon of the path. Bye. Uh, um, <laughs> what, how about one and two is left, three and four is right. I'm surprised okay. you can't, like, flip a coin or something. Four. That's, that's right. Okay, the right is... Let's, let's the take coin. the road less traveled. The road... I was about to say that, actually. The um, the right one is slightly less traveled, and you can see that there is still a small group of people, like, down at the very far end. Oh, uh, it's there's like a part is outside. Just saying you can flip a coin. Okay. It's just a D2. Oh, is oh that makes sense. Oh. Wait, I don't see a D2. I only see a D4. You just type uh, slash roll uh, 1D2. you imagine a D2? Wow. It's a coin. Oh, yeah! 1D1. <laughs> no, that did not even do anything for me. <laughs> oh, there it goes. Oh, that's kind of... Yes, oh, yes. Wait. Did you, yeah, that's you rolled... <laughs> that's the weirdest dice I've ever seen is a 169. <laughs> One D sixty nine apparently. Get out of here. <laughs> yeah, 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 perfect sixty nine. <laughs> perfect sixty nine. You okay? Natural sixty nine. Oh yeah, no, but uh. So yeah, you guys, you you guys notice that there's two uh, there's two branching paths a little bit further on. You can see that there's a little signpost, and then it kind of keeps going farther on off. Did you? Which guys did you choose? Which one? Uh, um, I'm, right. I'm going right. Guys, right. if you guys have choose, right? Dice, everybody's right. Everyone's right. Okay, so uh, you guys start heading off down the right trail. There's no real end in sight. It looks like it goes on for quite a while. Like okay. I like I said, a little little ways down, you see a group of people, and there's a small branching path off on the right hand side that has a little sign. Uh, I'm gonna I stop and read the sign. Uh, oh, yeah. Okay. 
Okay, the sign's too weathered to wear to read it. Ah, okay. Are you Some sure sign. none of us speaks reads uh, weathered? It sounds like a uh, bad sign. I mean, you. I don't know. You can do a I'm perception break the check sign too. Because it's What's the sign made out of? The sign's made out of wood. I'm gonna break the sign because I'm angry. I can't read it. Uh, roll a strength check then. Um. <laughs> What does he need to break a broken wooden sign? <laughs> Don't Let's worry see. about that. I get a plus two to my roll. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna roll a d10. Uh, roll a d20. Read d20. Yeah. I'm just, yeah I, I just I wanted to roll one, just so like he can, like try to punch it, and miss, fall forward, and like hit his head on the. On I the get a plus two, so it'd be you 20. only lose if you roll a one. Did you say a three? No, I got a 19. You know, oh, you can, like, damn. like, in your character sheet, you can just click strength and it rolls a strength check for you. Oh, well, yeah. I got a plus two to my strength. So. Okay, so it's That's 21. 21. So you try and break the sign? Yes. Okay, you so... <laughs> break that goddamn sign. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, you grab it and just snap it in two like it was a twig. Because it is a you twig. take it and of. use it as a sign for later use? If you want. I wanted Next. you to... I wanted Pick you to knock the wood. that, but then you like punch it. It doesn't break, and you break your hand. <laughs> well, if he would have, yeah. Okay. Just imagine um, that would be a one. Well, I'm gonna keep I, the sign. So okay, you you now achievement get. You got I, sign. I feel like the sign would have been an important sign. <laughs> well, you're not gonna know that now. <laughs> you know, maybe it was. It was. To decipher it. it was pointed in an arrow-like oh. shape, so I don't know. Yeah. You might. Pointed it was, arrow -like like shape. Said, you never said it was an arrow-shaped sign. Well, like I said, it has kind of like a point to it, so you could kind of use it as something later on, but that's up to you. Our squid left either way. What? Our squid left. As you can see, the pixels, there's a few less. Huh. Are you sure? Our Let me just... Yeah. Just keep going. Just I, I guess, going. yeah, I do see like a slight pixel change. Yeah. I don't know. I'll have to wait a minute to see if there's actually been any change. No, there's definitely... Okay, there uh, we go. Oh, there's oh. A, a squid's back. Squid is deeply shamed. Why would you do? <laughs> squid has to make dinner. All right, make me some dinner then. I will. Um, so, uh, breaking the sign uh, knocked the... Uh, what's I, well, I still like the idea that he went to go hit it. Knocked squid, it. knocked squid into a coma, and he conveniently passed out in the back of the cart for a little while. Uh, Very convenient. Squid is unconscious. Yep. <laughs> nobody, nobody. It's his head on the sign. Body parts. <laughs> we, half, we put him on the uh, the cart. Yeah. And he'll okay. Okay. So. Comas, uh, uh, Iramir takes a, just falls randomly into him. Just like natural minotaurs just have natural comas that last as long as it would take a human to use the bathroom. Say what? I went into a coma. For as long as it would take for a human to use the bathroom. All right, then. I'm not carrying him. <laughs> no, he just yeah, falls down I and passes out for a there. second. He can get up on his own. <laughs> okay, could well, have you... been an elf who did that. We could have just set you on there and you're good. It's a freak, the freaking minotaur. It's all right. <laughs> well, you guys still have... I mean, you broke the sign, but that was about it. What are you guys doing we, next? We or keep should... going. You want to wait for them to come back or at least... No, Android? we keep going. Well, which way? Help? Okay, can I, can I just... Interject if you want. We spelled professionals wrong. <laughs> <laughs> really? I mean, that works for the hashtag professional. Uh, I guess. <laughs> all these people. Well, we, we all said right, right? Yeah, you like, said right, right for the initial one, but right. like I said, there was a secondary path. That uh, oh, squid was, broke the frickin'. He didn't look. He just broke the side. I said we go down that path. This gang. Okay, so who's going where? I'm going down the path. Okay. I, I'm going to follow the panda. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. So you got it's it's kind of a uh, a thicket, like a bit of a dense brush, and you guys walk through. It's still easily passable by Geb, who is a massive friggin' panda. And um, I'm on all fours, though. It's still passable. It's probably a good eight. You know, you oh, still no. have like you know eight feet of clearance or so. Um, yeah. So yeah, it's it seems like it's kind of like a canopy, and you're walking down a somewhat used but still pretty wild path. Right. And 
in the distance. Um, you can see that there's a little bit of lights and you hear some sounds. That's about it. Um, roll a... No, that's up to you. Roll a what? D20? I was, I was going to say roll a perception check, but I was going to say that's up to you. <laughs> well, yeah, of course, perception check. Yeah. Um, if you want to, go for it. 11. Okay. Uh, wait, uh, 14. Like I said, click on your character sheet. It just does it for you. Um, I want to. Then don't. It, it, like, covers up a lot of stuff. That's why I don't do it. Oh. Sure. Um, okay, so yeah, um, 11, or 14, right? Yeah. You can kind of smell a bit of burning fire, like, kind of, it smells like a small fire is going up top, and From you what? can, he's walking down that path that Squid broke the sign for. Oh. Uh. Yeah. And, um, you can see that there are some shapes moving around up front. It looks like there are a bunch of people moving and sitting around a fire. I go, I hail fellow travelers. The, um, the guys, they, they kind of like turn back for a second. And then they just keep on going with their thing. Uh, in front of the fire, or behind the fire, you can see that there's kind of like a small little tavern there. Mm-hmm. Uh, Let's there's, go to the tavern. There's, yep. Can I fit in the tavern? It's a standard human-sized tavern, so you can try, but I don't Ooh. know. <laughs> Roll a squeeze check. Get, get out of here. Hold on, hold on. I also have advantage. Uh, I also do have a... Uh, nope, plus zero to strike. Plus two to dexterity, so I got a 15, because I dexterously fit into the building. Well, I didn't really <laughs> have you roll for anything, but good job. Wait, no. No, I got plus four acrobatics. I forgot, so no, it would be plus 17. I acrobatically got into the building. If I, you want to... I, I backflipped um, in. If you want to go into the building, sure. I got a 10... What's going on? I'm I'm confused. He, there's a tavern, and he's just rolling for things. Um, I'm a seven foot tall panda. I was trying to see if that would work. I'm seven foot two. <laughs> Go yeah, on, he's... man. Let's fit in there. I rolled a ten. Yeah, <laughs> GL, bro. <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on. Uh, I've got plus plus one dexterity. Oh, oh, hold on. I'm gonna ride, I'm gonna do a strength check. To Go. break into the tavern. Oh, that's Jesus. a good idea. <laughs> just break it. Just yeah, tavern. I can just. I'll just break it. Destroy it. The, I'll break it so that the door is bigger. Yeah, that's not gonna get us kicked out. Poor, poor tavern. Fucking strength check nineteen. Um. Well, I didn't really have you roll a strength check, but you know, congrats on taking the initiative. Um. <laughs> Yeah. Okay. Are you actually trying to? Are you actually trying to break through the door? I'm trying to push like myself in, and if I don't squeeze in, then I'll just break a, a me-shaped hole in the wall. Well, I could just tell you that too. You know, you you squeeze in. I mean, it's you can hear that the threshold is kind of um, it's it's bending a little bit and creaking. You can hear it <laughs> as you squish your uh, minotaurly body through that door. But you guys make it in. Uh, the The roof is about seven five, so you have a tiny bit of clearance. <laughs> and inside, you Did see we break the chairs? what? I don't know. I haven't even gotten that far yet. <laughs> inside, you see a small little bar, and there is a dwarven patron who is behind it. He just kind of looks at you incredulously, like, and he goes, "Ah, I'm surprised you got in here." And there's a few. So are we in the good accent? There's a few small, there's a few patrons sitting on stools and whatnot. There's a small fireplace over in the corner, and there's a stairway going up to a second story. I'm going to say I, probably we can't fit in the second story. I don't know if the floor okay. will hold you. Speak, just, just speak common. I speak common. No, no, no. Does the common. dwarf. Yeah, he, the yeah, he, he spoke, he said that in common. We wouldn't be able to understand him. What? We wouldn't yeah, be able to understand him. talk common. I can. Oh, check yeah, it's my, like your overnight course or something. Check my updated <laughs> GED. Yeah, he... <laughs> Community college. He got, last, he got an overnight time, GED. It was only because I didn't write it on the sheet. So if I write it on the sheet... Because Minotaurs do speak common. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, but your specific Minotaur never said on its character sheet. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Yeah. He can. I guess he can speak common if he really wants. 
So I'm like, what's on the second floor? Uh, that's, that's, uh, there's a few rooms there if you want to sleep. That's about it. Hmm. This is just a simple tavern. We don't want any trouble. We don't want any trouble either. Why are you so racist? You are very big. And you almost <laughs> broke my doorway. So you're sizest then, huh? Listen. Are you fat, are you fat shaming us? There's no such <laughs> thing as D&D &D Tumblr, right? <laughs> Actually, there probably I is, but that's really the defensive. point. Excuse my uh, SJW friend here. Um, can we... <laughs> or can we... Can we have some uh, some ale or anything? Some hard Great. cider? Uh, some wine coolers? Listen, if you just will go sit down and not break anything, then yeah, I'll get you a drink in a second. Can, can I have some mead? If you'd like. The mead's only uh, five gold a, a five gold yeah, a how mead? Stein. There you go, and I just, I just flick into him. Okay. <laughs> What's mead? I guess... Is that what you said? I guess, I guess they're getting drunk, I don't know. <laughs> I, I am getting drunk. Meat is delicious. <laughs> we have you haven't gotten it. You, you have to sit down first. Yeah, go course, sit. Go sit in the sit corner. Down. I'll have someone come to you. All right, I what, sit down. To, like ask what we want to drink. Yes, this is a tavern a after all. Table because the panda takes up the entire table by himself. I swear. Uh, I, he he whispers to you, um, Ali. Uh, listen, if your friend uh, breaks any of my uh, stools, I. I'll light him on fire. I'm not sitting on a stool, though. I'm sitting on the floor. Oh, I, I'm pretty sure he deserves it at this point. If oh, he does. oh, thank Christ. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry. Oh, thank Thanos. So oh, I don't, I don't know what D and D <laughs> gods are. So let's see. I'm gonna look that up while we're Did while you we're say sitting. Thank Thanos. That that's the only thing I could think of that's not like <laughs> Nor the Marvel villain Thanos. <laughs> Thanos is also the god of death, bro. Oh, oh, okay. oh Sorry, as, that's right, Asmodeus is D&D. &D. But I don't yeah. know who the Dwarven patron is, so... Dwarvina? Yes, yes, Dwarvina, the Dwarven patron. Are, are you dropping no, the ball just, now? Just, just Not memorizing Thor. your D&D &D It's mini Thor. Lore. Yeah, because I've, I know all the D&D &D lore. <laughs> I've heard the Ishtar. I can't, I just, that's what my mind does. Jesus, there's like four or five hundred gods. Fuck that. Okay, so... <laughs> Are any of them Cthulhu or the flying spaghetti monster? It better fucking be. Is there not like a dwarven god? I'd be really surprised. Yeah, can I just be a Pastafarian minotaur? Go away. Yes, you can. <laughs> okay, well, never mind then. We're just, I'm just going to use like some standard pantheon that I see here. Okay. Oh, cool. People can see that in XSplit. That's great. What? I, All your porn tabs? Uh, I actually have no tabs open. Okay, so those oh, are all the different ones. Oh, I'm sorry. Think Ishtar. Yes. Okay, so, anyway. Any, Whatever you guys are talking anyway. about. Okay, so you guys are sitting down, I guess? Yeah, I am. Yeah. I realize that I'm a paladin who's supposed to be super religious, yet I know nothing about the gods and by me. It's you not right. Pick a you're, a bad, you're bad at being a paladin. <laughs> I'm a terrible well... paladin. I'm the worst. <laughs> okay, anyway, so... You, um, I guess you guys are sitting there, and a little half-orc girl comes up to you, and she, she kind of... Just all start hitting on her and She kind of, she kind of looks at, uh, she looks at Geb and, or Geb and Iramir, and, Iramir, sorry, and she's, like, she's like, ah, do, do you guys need anything? She's, she's a little, she's a little afraid of massive creatures. I just look at her and I say, hey, can I have some, uh, mead? Please. Yeah, yeah, hold on. You, you want anything? She's pointing at uh, Iramir. Oh, I'm like, yeah, can I see your um, your hard liquor menu? Yeah, I think she kind of hands you a uh, menu of various things and she scurries I, I, off. I look over at him and I say, are you old enough to drink? <laughs> I look at him and say, not in the Minotaur world, but in the human world, yes. How old are you anyway? Aren't you like a hundred? I'm twenty-four year. I'm twenty-four regular years old. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm only twenty-five. So, but I feel like that's six in Minotaur. The image of this giant ass Minotaur with like squeaky <laughs> hen voice, just the funniest. That's fucking six. That's six years old in Minotaur. Oh, I oh, want six. Hard liquor. Damn, six years old. You're banging stuff out quickly, huh? Oh, 
But don't tell him that. Squid is going to be so damn lost. My parents would, my parents would be, like, astonished if I, if they knew that I, like, drank and lost my virginity at Minotaur three years old. And That's a weird thought. A weirder thought than that is that, that we're running out of time. So, guys, if you want to see some more D&D where we hopefully can finish a quest within the next six or seven hours, yes. then, um, yeah... I might, I might liken our odds, though. Yeah, I, I'm pretty sure we're not going to. But, we'll you know... We'll get joined back next time. All right. Oh, Anyways, yeah, we'll, yeah, we'll see oh. you guys in, uh, in the next one, all right? Later.